Come on, come on. Yes, yeah, no path. I had a couple of trouble with trick or treaters, you know. It's any good jokes? Peanuts, Mars bars, or tangerines? No? Okay. Your trousers, man. You could have well, washed them. Well, I don't know how to wash sure. them. If people, if, if, if people can write in and tell me how to wash these particular trousers, I don't know whether I should dry clean them or what. You see, now look at that. So your single's been chosen as the as the help single, Lucky. How did that feel? Considering all the bands that were on it, and stuff, it was it was um, we were pretty honoured. Yeah. Um, other than that, it was we didn't we didn't really want to. Um, get heavily involved because we wanted to wanted it to be mostly, you know, to to be a collective thing. Really. And so this single is actually going to help the War Child charity. We had information about War Child and we talked to some people who run it, and it was it looked like a slightly more slightly more ego-free version of some of the uh, you know band band involved charities. And we were, we were into it, and we were really happy that Lucky was chosen because we we recorded our best song of that month that we'd written. You know, we went in and just released, re-released something or re-recorded something, so it was gratifying. They sort of got you the right time. Though. Yeah, exactly. You've been touring quite a lot recently. Where have you been? America mostly. Japan. Ed had his cricket bat confiscated yeah. at Chicago Why? Airport. Chicago Airport. We were, we decided to take out the cricket bat. And no, uh, you did. I don't okay, we and. Uh, I got to the got to the customs and everything. They said, uh, "What are you doing with this paddle?" <laughs> paddle, sir? <laughs> I said, "How dare you, sir? This is a cricket bat." Yes. 